What we want to do is give you a brief demonstration of a new product coming available that we feel would really be a great advantage to people that are doing motorcycle tank painting and we feel that we could have quite an impact by giving you this little video so that you could actually see the product. Place your tank onto the new piece of equipment, position it as such, and if I was ready to paint, I could do my bottom of my tank and my sides, and just that fast I could come back, reposition, reposition my tank and with the use of this new tool just as quick as this we could just paint this tank just this fast this is just to explain that of all the different styles and sizes that were produced over the years each one of these rubbers here accommodates a different era and size of the tank. But the main thing is, is to select your three pieces that closely fits your opening and then proceed from there to put your pieces together, get them pre-tightened, insert it, Tighten it down like this till it's good and tight. Check for your I'll just give you a brief overview of the actual stand itself. It has a wheeled base, which is very nice for storing it or moving it. And it has a vertical adjustment for height. It has a rotation shaft, which will allow the operator to rotate around the horizontal axis and it locks in different locations and it can be turned all the way each spot once it's locked into place provides for handoff operation while you're doing the painting process handle's got a nice lever and a spring loaded pin up here this attachment area, this pin here and your handle, your hole lines up with that. And what we have here is the ability to just quickly connect it and a locking knob on this side which will prevent this from turning or by loosening it, now the operator has the ability to use this around the vertical axis and he can position himself. Now what is nice about this is that the other accessories that are available would allow a person that wishes to do detail work to actually and probably one of the most comfortable positions he'll ever work in is to be able to get himself in a position to where he could do artwork, airbrushing just like this and with very little effort be able to continue working from a comfortable position and get a really good view of what your operator would be seeing is this auxiliary stand and what it comes into play as you've seen before is once you've painted a tank like in this case here this tank here is a split tank do one half you're able to come over here take it off your paint stand and place it here. Now you have your heater for curing and it frees up your paint stand to paint other parts while these are placed out of the way.